Hi. In this video, I will explain how to take online assessments, tests, interviews, and exams with Quilgo. I will split the video into several parts. First, I will show what a link to an online test looks like. Then I will share a few tips on how to prepare for your online test with Quilgo. Next, I will explain how to configure access to the camera and screen if the automated proctoring is enabled. Finally, I will show you how to take online tests and submit your answers. Let's start with a link you received. You may have received either a group or a direct link to your test. If you received a group link, it will show an authentication window. You can enter your email manually and receive your direct link in your inbox or authenticate with Google. You do not need to authenticate if you received a direct link initially. Please note that some tests can start at a specific time and may not be available immediately. Also, pay attention to the duration and whether overtime is allowed. Before you take your test, make sure to follow these simple steps. Choose a quiet environment and ensure you do not have any immediate things to do. Distractions can potentially put you out of focus and lower your score. Also, ensure the software on the device you use for your online test is updated. Finally, stay calm and focused for better results. If the test owner enables automated proctoring, you might need to provide access to your camera or screen. Once the test starts, act as if you were in a class or in-person interview. That is the best possible strategy to get better results. Avoid searching for answers on the internet or communicating with others unless explicitly allowed, as this can potentially affect your results. Once you submit your test, depending on the test settings, you might see your score immediately or need to wait until the test owner releases the results. I hope this video was helpful. We wish you good luck with your online tests with Quilgo.